Yo, 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 Daniel here, Good Combos, Season 2, and this is Episode 2, you know we joined by g the one and only, give thanks bro. I don't know, Yeah. I know we all try and we active, facts, facts, we look happy plug. <laughs> <laughs> Straight. Yo, dog, I, I just always say this thing about, I think we planned that long too. Yeah, that interview was supposed to happen for a minute. Um, for everybody who don't know GRS is a local dancer artist. In my opinion, one of the best, one of the pioneers as well too. Um, yo, like, how, how your career started? Uh, my career started some years back in Jack. Like, when I now finished secondary school, like, in secondary mm. school, I had the vibes of music, actually, because I was in the head couple other students in it don't have the similar vibes like yeah, me yeah. in Jekyll and Shunia. So we always just say like, we had a couple who used to be beating the desk, you know, and we singing and creating a kind of vibes, yeah. you know, so all that was our vibes in Jekyll. And then me, for myself, no, I just have a, a passion and a love for music mm. in Jekyll and Shunia. I really love music. I listen to a lot of music in Jekyll until I decided, no, I could create my own music, you know, I could bring out my side of the story mm. through music and check out show you wait so you have like you have a musical background in your family or that was just your thing no that's that just my thing mm. you know nobody in the family before me who the same wait so at what age you write your first song then well, the first the first tune coming when i was i ain't talking about like the first one you recorded like first little the first little yeah. writing yeah. i mean yeah. That could have been around when I was like 16, 17. You yeah, right? Yeah, you know, he, he, he was like, uh, because I was tapping my foot in a room, you check? Yeah. And then the room and I tapping my foot, so, you know, if I'm going to disrespect me, I'm going to have a special tooth with me, aka Killer Boy, from a page, I right buy, and do what he could at night, all day, tell you pussy, don't stray, age strong, no play, never, you know, and he just, he just have vibes, you know, and then from there, you know, I just get the vibes, you know? Mm. It's like, I was excited, still, I was like, you know, and then, you know, that, I create a whole verse, you know, because sure. you know, just one part. But at first, no, I didn't really have the, the full courage, you know, because within myself now, I was like, wow, and now people go look at me, you know, mm-hmm. and I, if my friends, I will really take heed and really, yeah. you know, read me, concerning music, you know, and, and that was always part of in my mind, just the same way, I check. I feel like something a lot of new artists was, was there's a problem a lot of new artists just had to overcome. But then, no, here comes, um, Versatile, but they change the name to Dan Peel. Dan Peel, right? Yeah. Shout, so, shout out, shout out Dan, Dan Peel. Dan Peel, pick yeah. up yourself. You don't know yeah. the thing. It's down for life. Yeah. So it was Dan Peel and Bongo. Now you know with the with the Rainfire School. You know, right. they meant been right. singing years before me. You ain't check out Shirley. They had the family. They have like white takes. You ain't check out Shirley, but they just didn't have the level of courage now to put music out. To put music out to the world. You ain't check out Shirley. And when I meet them now, you know, for see, which is down pill now, you know, was yeah. about nine certain key things and key factors in the music, you know. And them thing that was key towards my career, you didn't check out show, you know, mm. leading up to today, you know, over that show, you know, because things were he taught me, stay with me from since them time up to now. Why is what why is one thing Don Peel said to you that you think you remember for the rest of your career? For the rest of my career? Yeah. I want piece of advice I remember. Uh, he's a man, alright. Uh, he was like that. When I created Madame Bad, first shoot. Right. But I was officially writing. You didn't check out you know, for myself, you know? I was supposed to do that show for myself. And how that show come about is another story for yourself. You didn't check out show. Part so, two, part two. Yeah, part two. I was now creating the show. I built the chorus, had the first verse, mm. and then now I was move on to the second verse now. And I just keep it's like I just keep telling myself, yo. You do what you have to do already. You could get somebody else to jump on the track. Right. So hear me now telling Don P, yo, Don P, thing. 
You have to jump on that boy, you know? Because, you know, he's the man that teaches me, you know? I look excited, you do a tune tune thing, you know? Don't you listen to the tune, you know? Don't you listen, listen. Then don't you turn and watch me watch. GB did me and I don't want to be on that tune. Yeah. You have to finish that tune for yourself. You're over as I show you. Your soul man tell me, you check. You have to finish that tune for yourself. And you see, when I come and check you, anytime I come back and check you, song the finish. that song had to finish. You're over as I show you. Mad and bad. Mad and bad. You have to tell you? Well, I didn't really like the the quality of the production. Yes, right, they right. are YouTube, you check, but the quality is now, how I should say it, up to the standard way. That you would want it. Yes. Yeah. That how was, much that was one of the problem for me. That was back in 2017. Okay. Okay. You check. okay. I recorded that tune late 2016, so you can say, yeah, only 2017. Yeah, so 2017, I do that tune. That was mm. mad and bad, you know? And that was, a, that was again, a good feedback from that tune. Nice. You know? Like people around, other people, you know, they dig the vibes in the tune, so the encouragement started to grow. Mm. You know, but then with the drive and the will I have behind music now, I just, deep inside, I just knew I had to take it to another level. We didn't check out show, you know, but I just wasn't around the right set of people now to really help me reach that level, I check, because I was in a pass through one studio. I do tune, they, them tune never come out. They check out show, I go to our next studio, yeah. looking for a level of quality. The quality wasn't there, and the producer had advice, but he intentions and minds do lining up. What okay. he really wanted is now what I wanted, you know? Sure. Then was more focused on like having me come in and just calling up other artists' name and this them, you know, as I show oh. And I wasn't on that. Nah, you you trying to build your career? I want to build my career yeah. for myself. I don't want to come and call nobody's name. I try to fight with this nobody who I literally don't know. I don't know anything about them. I just know they're doing music. Mm -hmm. And they might be there before me. They check so I will just come and feel, well, yeah, I could just call up the name and this them and that will take me somewhere. No, nah. you ain't check out show. And I wasn't that For type all of inspiring artists, artists <coughs> Take a, take a picture on this experience because that is not a good thing to trust me. If you want to build a career, start on your own. Yeah, the bill, Try the And as, as you have said, you went to one studio, he wasn't content. He went to another studio, he didn't give up. So, I'll let you take a picture. Yeah, because on from, from that studio, he would meet another studio in Springs, you know. Mm. And then I was kind of getting the vibes that I, that was really the part they know you know I could Facts. go forward the check and them time they know I still wasn't heavy on the dance out. Mm. So I used to be before? Rap. 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 You know, okay. Yeah, I used to be rap. That is, that is yeah. why your name is LG, yes? Where the, where the other name come out? Yeah, that name come out from childhood. Okay. You know, growing up with many guys and them in the hood. Well, one person in particular, you know, and then the name stick because before people used to call me Munga. Munga. Yeah. And then now uh, the name come about with the with the gangster ass. Mm. You check and then otherwise than the gangster ass now is is like this. Like every time I pull up, ba ba I pull up in an event and go in and then go be like, are you drinking? G, G, G. So it's like that name just Stick come there and yeah. you know, the soul has started call me G and you see by from today, you know, G Ras. You didn't check out showing you and just so the name come G Ras, you know. And then when I was family to myself into becoming the artist that I wanted to be now. Mm. People didn't know Giras. You didn't check because Giras didn't really have substance, they didn't really have nothing behind it yet. Mm. People know me, you know, they know me them time as Munga, there was more gravitating to the Munga, you check? Right. And I had to find a way now to get rid of the Munga because Munga is not really my original thing. Because if you, if you check out, Munga is done an artist in Jamaica, eh? you Munga check Munga and Munga, 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 particular artist, you check. If you can name three of the top of head. Well, for me, Movado and Cartel. Facts. Are a big part of play. Right. I mean, check out show, you know. Movado and Cartel is key. They're the, they're the OGs. They're the OGs. And then, no, on the other hand, no, 52. I mean, check they're rapper. Show, they're rapper. Right. They're all over right. show, you know. And I'm growing up now. Them time, they're 50 now. Oh, yeah. Bar no, and and you know, them children, they're <laughs> no coming out and bagging. And like, them children, they're digging the vibes, you know, 50 years, man, 50 years, man, artists, you know, them kind of way. Really. 
Yeah, and then move around cartel with the war now, you know. Then I analyze the war on a different level, you know. Cartel is a racist. You can check out show and move around the man with the voice. You know, you know, you know, right, 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 Yeah. So what category would you put GRS in? I make sure I put them in. Yeah. That is exactly what I'm going on. You can check out show you. I want to use the voice, different style and flow, different pattern. You check out, I want to use the lyrics by bringing across different story, different vibes. It overs and then I just base my tune on, on a topic. So mm -hmm. if I'm singing about gun, it's just gone in that tune. If I'm singing about a girl, it's just so about would a you, girl. Would you would you say machine man? Would you say Giras is more of like a, a storytelling than Salatism? Storytelling, you know? Yeah. Realistic and some friction. Mm. It overs, because I could be like tuna for something I never really see happen. You know, that's what I show. Once I had a concept mm -hmm. and the rhythm is right, I could continue with the tune. And so, I could be a realistic tune. So why is why is um why does go away making music? Like what was what was inspired to write a new song? It's based on the vibes are there. You see the mood are there and the rhythm. Mm. You see if I day in a or I should say, if I did in a in a in a dark state of mind, the rovers like I met in certain things that we call dark the rovers and yeah. the rhythm or get is that type of rhythm then they will get that that type of tune. They will check they might get a vicious violin tune where I might put certain things in it, you check. I might not do it in you check or show you, but it's things that I just think about right. and it's things that if you reach a circumstance where I have to do it, I will do it. Mm -hmm. You check or show you. And that is the reason why I have it. It works. Facts. And that is Facts. what I just go about. You check. Facts. Yeah. Okay. So I will come, play a rhythm, you check. And some type of rhythm too will speak to me. The rovers are showing. So just for now, I might play a rhythm. I might be in a state of mind. And then no. when I listen to the rhythm twice, three times, sometimes I get the first two bars. You check. I get a concept. Mm. The rovers. And then I just start developing it from the. You know, mm -hmm. I continue until I complete the chat. I check and then I just I just check them to make sure. You know, check because you choose now, you have certain tunes you have built, and then I might just change certain bars and things. Yeah. You know, as well. yeah. Just because of the vibes. Yeah. You, know, check, you might get a different tune I talk to. You know, but I'm add it in. Yeah. You know, check. So sometimes you no, know, you have tune now, where I will sit on. And I could build it in an hour. Mm. You know, but I mean, you have that tune now, where I'll come. And I could start in that hour, but I can finish today. Yeah, finish. The rovers because of the level of vibes. Yo! Because the level of vibes. Yeah. yeah. What I'm saying is, your yeah. advice for the youths is something I want all artists on the platform to, to provide whenever I do an interview. So, what yeah. advice do you ask for the youths? Well, to be honest, I could advise the youths. Yeah, right? But then again, is is if the youth willing to take that advice, mm. over sure. because True. them still have the last say, and them still have to make that decision. Yeah, you know, in yeah. what they really want to be a part of. In Chicago, for me, I will encourage youth to be involved in progressful thing. The check thing what could uplift them, take them from one state to a higher. Invest in yourself. Check investments. Think about things where I could invest in. In Chicago, because money is a key thing. In, 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 in the modern life today. Yeah, you yeah, check out yeah. show. Yeah. And in order to have money, you have to go and work. Uh, you have to hustle. You can check out show. And you have to invest in order to, 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 to always sustain a level of stability when it comes to money. You I mean, check. not only that too. I mean, if you want to live a certain lifestyle, you, have, you need money to, to support your lifestyle. So, yeah. Because even if they want to live, as how some would say badness, they want to live a badness lifestyle. They don't have the money to live their life. Mm -hmm. You know, as I because back to the parents and them now who had to make that sacrifice of going to work every day. Yeah. They check out showing and come and fight to go for a lawyer, fight to come and get a bill. They don't check out showing. So best they just behave themselves. Yeah. You know, and so, focus on. So are they from and, us? And progressful thing. You know, Investing in yourself, progressful thing. You check. No time for sky lockers. And money. Money is very important. You know, check. It's a fact. It's yeah, a fact. Your biggest hit, Jiras. What would you say it is? But when I say my biggest right. hit, you have different ways how somebody could calculate okay. someone's so biggest hit. I, I, I would, most people just calculate 
I'm a big is it based on views. Get over so show you. Alright, alright, well, I understand what you're saying. So let me rephrase the question. Your biggest hit based on how the masses. How, 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 what message you get back to the masses? Let you say, like, somebody will pass you on the street and say, yo, that tune bad. Well, majority of my tunes on them, well, all my tunes on them get feedback. You know, check out right. All of them get feedback, whether it's good, whether it's like criticism, good or bad, because mm. I don't listen to criticism. You have to, check you have to. Because I won't go get vexed with somebody for criticizing something. I will listen to what they say. We didn't check our show and analyze it and see probably how I could progressive thing in yeah, check our show. Yeah, yeah. So that the vibes. The low Shit. Vibes. Yeah. Shit. But I kinda of straight from the question. No, that is right, man. The question is um based on your feedback, where I think is your yeah. most the most tune the two others get a high level of feedback from some of my me me day one fans and them uh, is in our real life. In our real life. Is, yeah. And that could that is my first official dance out show. Which mm. Marambar was the first dance out show I do. But to me it didn't go out official. So you check out show me. So I consider in a real life to be the first official dance out show. Oh, why inspired that song? Uh, the, the, that song was just based on me, you know, how, mm. how, how, how I go in about life, you know, because people have a tendency of just seeing you and just judging you. Yeah. Like you're cool yeah. and you're quiet, they yeah. just feel like you're cool, you think, mm. you they see that. You ain't check out shit, you know, but as I tell you, you know, it's just the, the, the it's a personal thing within me, you know, mm. how people might go about judging people, you know. And it's on face that value. And face value, you check. Yeah. They just see you and just picture you as that. Because of how you will move. Yeah, you know, but what I'm saying is, eh? That's a bad thing to do. Because yeah. somebody can really be that dangerous, but choose to control yourself. You understand? You understand? And that is what some of us, as humans, just fail to realize. Mm. You check our show. So in our real life, was inspired based on that? We was based on that, you check. Because, like, I explained to them now. And I is a gangster in our real life. They all of us are showing up. But I won't go. You won't go see me like chilling there, uh, doing this, uh, involving that. You ain't check out Mafia show. movements. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. That makes sense. Yo, so um, I know you have your, 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 your group Zone It. Yeah, Zone It is, Zone it is a label. The label, right? Yeah, Zone It. And, uh, and, uh, and the verge of, well, could say his. The first official dance music label in Guinea. In Guinea. And he feels good to be a part of the movement. Nice. You know? yeah. Nice. But always and I have I have my label where uh, I'm pushing us, which is which is website production. Website production. Yeah. Yeah. 45. Nice. Nice. 95 for me. Nice. So the five and the eight. I mean, and people don't get twisted. Eh? We we know we don't endorse violence in no way. This is just an artistic form of expressing what's what's going on in our daily lives and our day to day basis. Understand? I um I I normally have conversations with elderly people because that's just me. And whenever I ask them what is your opinion on, on the emerging dance scene, really, it's only violence, this violence, that violence. Yeah, because that. the reason for that being is no. It's something about violence that has always just draw No, but sex, attention. sex sells. You know, people should watching. know this by now. You know, as I should. But I hear now, people would make the statement that dance uh, and violence, there is a violence. Why mm -hmm. I would see it too. They check. I go just see it as now. That is what people choose to check on. They that is what they check. choose to blame on. They, check. they choose to check on and blame on your violent music. You know, mm -hmm. as I you. But we have positive music. Check. If you is not a fan of the violin music, then don't listen to, listen to the violin music. Yeah. Listen to our positive music because we have positive music that you could dig and mix. You and check, and you will be too. uplifting. Yeah. You check, and I don't need to check out this music and then get over. Stop being drawn and attracted to videos with cutlass and guns. Get over, and then you're discriminating us. Get over, because all we're doing is entertaining. Yeah. I can come and sing about a badness tune and then 
in the video I come and I move like a punk or like a sissy. If you understand, yeah, I, I check where you're coming from. You don't fit it. I have to sell the product. Yeah, you don't you fit check? it. Yeah. It's just like if I come in and sing a girl tune, you know, over as well, I show you. And based on the type of girl tune I'm doing, and I'm doing a video, and you don't know girl in the video. If you understand where I'm coming from, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. like you just you don't have enough sense. Bro. Yeah, you make sense. This Funny. is just an art form, as I see. So don't discriminate. Just support the thing because at the end of the day, I feel all I was just doing is just uh, two reasons I don't say we're doing this thing to elevate yourself and to elevate you either. But we're not doing this thing just for yourself. You realize? Because I have a purpose why I, why yeah, I started Happy Plum. It's true. Because, because in the sense of dancer and yeah, Happy Plum, like how you start doing your, your, brand, your yeah. brand and pushing your brand. That is good, you check. And more youths, although all the youths won't go be able to do it, yeah. but more youths should be getting involved in this type of thing. Yeah, yeah. Check out show, rather than wasting the time. I will. I think. Us. I think the mere fact that we get, even if we get at least one or two, to start something that is way better than none. You check. Way way better than none. So, two more questions before we finish. It have any local artists that you're looking to collab with? Uh, you have. You have, you have, you have artists that I collab with, uh, well, you know, non taxi. Yeah, Hanzo. Hanzo. Yeah. Have a, have a collab, they come in. But me and Fairly started working on Me and Devo have a collab, but they out already, mm. which is no evidence. Yeah. Me and Casper have a collab, but they out already, which is, um, slip me my name, my tune. <laughs> but yeah, me and Casper have a tune out. You can check out show you. Evil Meds, yes, Evil Meds. That yeah. is the name of the tune. Evil Meds part two. Me and Casper had a tune out the check. Yeah. Plus, I have a collab coming out just now with me, Toxic and Marius. The check. So then now, uh, you have other artists in the line. Do you have any, any foreign artists that you're hoping to collab with in the future? I would like to collab with in the future. Yeah. Because I, w I would assume. And I've been tapping into your music. I've seen you have a lot of collabs with local artists here. And I didn't put in that on the table. So that go happen. But it have any foreign artists that you really admire saying you know what? But I feel if we do our song together, that would be a good vibe. Yeah, you have a, you have a couple of artists. Very true. Mm. Yeah, that I was like really vibe to. And I would feel like, you know, you'll be a real plus if I could like one day. Name one. You could do a collab with them. Yeah. And uh, is a is a is a is a is a artist Facts. Facts. Yeah. Can't forget Cesar. He's a swan, you know. Yeah. And like TJ, you know, but yeah, and he and he a couple others, you know. I might even remember all of them at the top of my head now. Yeah. 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 I check, I check, I check. So last question. Um Happy Plug the brand. How comes to my when you see I hear you hear about Happy Plug? Happy Plug. Yeah. Is it is it the level of energy, bro? Facts. No, but I show you. Because I plug in life. While all of us know, plug was mainly useful. Correct. Yeah, in check out show. Yeah. And then the vibe you bring in is a positive and a good mm. vibe. You can check. You know, you're doing your little interviews and things. You know, even big. To say like big, you know, over as I was showing you, yeah. because we don't even have a camera, you know, over as I was showing you, but we're making it happen, you know, check? Facts. So, I'll go on YouTube and give this young dude here <laughs> the follows, the shares, you know, check, and the support, because we need that, you know, over I mean, as, yeah. you know, it is before me, just go ahead and support the artist, because without the artist, this platform would not be nothing at all. You understand? It's the so, G. You know, man. Support the artist. Why hit that subscribe button? Yo, it's have anybody on the shout out? Well, you know, yeah, a couple of, yeah, a couple of people, you know, I was like to shout out my father. You know, enough respect yeah. to my moms, you know, check, my sister, the rovers, and all the key persons in my circle. I won't go call everybody name, you know, check out show. Yeah, big up, you know big up, big up yeah. Zone, big up Westside yeah. Production. Big up Christo, you don't know the thing more. And check and big up all them young upcoming artists that are coming out and doing the thing. You ain't check out showing that is good. You know, continue on the path, you check. And try to be more creative with the craft than just focus on one set of things. 
you know? Yeah, I know the vibes. Yeah, let me, let me help Bill Grenada, man. We can make this thing benefit all of us. That's a fact. Bro, thanks for coming through, dog. It's been a real Respect. good conversation in your life. Eh? And you can shout out your socials if you want to. Eh? Yeah, you can go and follow GS Music on Facebook, GS Music Official on Instagram, GS Music, hashtag H Tongue Boss on TikTok. You can go and look for me on Twitter too, GS Music for 73. You can check the platforms and them there, you know? So. How about you the YouTube? G, you know, over, and, and YouTube is GS Music. Facts. You know, over, Facts. Yeah, GS Music. Yo, once again, this is Good Combos Episode 2, Season 2. This is Daniel here, and once again, GS. I don't know, it's the G, yeah. the one and only. <laughs> Tune in for Episode 3. Let's go. 45. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Don't know the thing going on. 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 Don't know the thing going on.